and we're back with more Jet Force Gemini. Finishing up this area of Rathessa. And Mark, you need to help me kill these guys. Oh. Ah. Start. Press start. There we go. Yeah. Yes. Turned off apparently last time. Yes, it, it was. Yeah, you definitely need my help against these guys. Come on, get over here. Die already, thank you. We don't want to... Yay! Think you can beat the next level in one... The next... Can, think you can do the next thing in one go? Bonus feature unlocked. Um... Because this is going to be the last video. Yes, the last video for this recording segment. Not that they would know that, unless you told them what you did. So thank you for that. Who freaking cares? I don't know! Okay, now this guy may look like Fishface, but he's actually Fernando Mole. Huh. So, uh, I'm going to do his voice. You can turn yourself off. <laughs> Sorry about Flopsy. She gets bored being stuck way out here. Actually, I get pretty lonely myself. Sorry about Flops, because she gets bored being stuck way out here. Actually, I get pretty lonely myself sometimes. I, er, don't suppose you got anything that could help take my mind off at all. I'd make it worth your while, of course. Nobody regrets doing business with old Fernando. Let's just say you help me out. I'll let you take a look around the mine, okay? Go on. It's really interesting. Great, er, historical value. And if it's tribals you're after, you can barely move for the little pests down there. That's assuming Flopsy hasn't sneaked in and eaten some since I last looked. So what do you so what do you say? Any offers? Well, maybe you'd like this. What's that? A magazine? Certainly looks like it could be prove a pleasant distraction during those solitary moments. Press the A button, Nick. Okay, we're cutting it off now. I'll just attach it to the next video. All right. And welcome back to the episode you are already watching. Uh, you know what, folks? We have such great planning skills. I mean, could have finished that last area off screen, and, you know, we would have had plenty of time to record this episode. But instead, I chose to finish that area on screen, thus uh, causing us to record when we didn't have a whole hell of a lot of time, so then we kind of had to, well, mesh two recordings together to make one episode. Again, our planning skills are awesome. Anyways, after talking with Fernando Mole, which uh, we'll probably have to do some editing on my voice recording work there, uh, due to a certain interference we now have the mind key so we can come in here i hope they don't mine us taking all our tri all their uh, tribal workers <laughs> mine i'm the king of bad puns and unfortunately for all of you i got a bajillion of them oh coins wow if stormtroopers lose to ewoks then tribals would have no chance against them <laughs> Uh, yeah. <laughs> bear like alien race versus bear like alien race. Yes. Uh, unfortunately, there isn't really a whole lot to talk about in this episode, as you guys can probably see from the lack of a secondary, uh, aiming cursor and from the fact that there's no sound constantly going on in the background mark really has virtually nothing to do in this episode it, it sounds so peaceful in here oh yes this uh this music is one of my favorite pieces and it's actually used in another area that we're going to be going to very very soon by the way you hear that tink tink Tink. Yeah. That uh, is the sound of a tribal mining. There's also a sound like that that's part of the music itself. It's nice to know to uh, identify the two because 
Some of these tribals like to hide like that. Uh, this guy, this guy, um, whoops, I did not mean to fire my gun. I was trying to get the strategy guy. Somebody is honking their horn outside. Why are they honking their horn outside? Oh, they do that sometimes. Oh yeah, this guy's farmer. He's uh he's not Fishface or Fernando, even though he looks exactly like them. Must be a trait of the species. You know what, since this is a different character, why don't you do the voice for him? Try to make his voice different from Fishface. Okay. Uh, he's a he's a miner, but he's still kinda up to no good. <laughs> a miner, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. You you guys are great! You're doing get a bang-up job! Keep it up! Well, that was not much. <laughs> oh, he has more to say. For there is more Hollow Guys action. Uh, let's see. I can't remember which way I want it to go. Is it this way or the other way? Well, we'll know as soon as we get there. I could just check the strategy guide map, but why would I want to do a sensible thing like that for? Yay for lack of foresight! The Pokemon attack that hits people... No, wait, that's not... No, I'm thinking of Future Sight. Foresight is the other one. Oh, yeah, this is this is where I want to go, actually. More elevator action! Woo! Elevator oh, action... Going. Elevator action, a classic arcade game. Must you... Ooh, more swimming. How does that elevator function? <laughs> well, it doesn't anymore, and that's just fine for me. If we had come from this bottom entrance here, then we would have jet-packed up into the bottom of the elevator. As you will see! Whoa! Yay. Also, um... We got 8 of 16. What do you mean, we? <laughs> Bonus activator. Thought I'd show that. Whee! Get out of the water. I know you like to swim, Vela, but get out of the water. Water. Water, my... Ah. My Bolomorian accent that I tried so hard to hide. It's... It's slipping! Dun, 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 dun. Peace for no enemies. Ah, uh, such a peaceful underground environment filled with a bunch of tribal slaves. Slave labor is awesome! <laughs> Yay, coordinate set, transfer complete. Transfer confirm. For the whole five of you that had Sega Saturns, you might get that reference. Uh, there really isn't that much to say in this episode. No, no, there, there really isn't. Um, ooh, actually, there's another hollow guide piece pad. Let's try to emphasize with the race by taking a walk in there. Ah, it's hideous! And this is coming from a self-proclaimed furry, and I think that thing's hideous. <laughs> did I just say that on camera? Yes, I did. Oh, well. It's not like, uh, it's too rare of a phenomenon. Uh, at least I'm honest about it. Ooh, looks like we're hitting the, uh, getting close to the ten-minute marker for this episode. Ooh. By the way, I, I almost tend to forget about you! There, finally just two left. 
There's one! Oh, I, I just want to say this. Tribal's got a gun. <laughs> the bugs are on the run. If they had guns, maybe they wouldn't be in this predicament. Well, the, you know, the Ewoks did fine without guns. <laughs> That's, uh, I think somebody messed up in that movie. It's like... Okay. It's like they wrote themselves into the into a corner. They're surrounded by Imperial troops, and their only only allies are these teddy bears. Somehow the teddy bears are gonna win. What? Teddy bears had their picnic. <laughs> um, swimming tribal. Yes. Oh, that reminds me. You can play as a tribal in uh, you can play as both male and female tribals in uh, multiplayer. Female tribal, of course, can swim like Vela. Male tribal can walk in lava like Juno, which makes no sense. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Doesn't make any dollars either, but, you know, you don't see me complaining. I could have you shoot the, you know, boxes and the switches just to give you something to do, but honestly, it's pistol ammo. <laughs> I, I'm not really hurting for the stuff, you know? But hey, you get to commentate. Oh, by the way, this guy thought it'd be a good idea to uh, get out a crap ton of Pokemon manga and uh, Pokey manga. Pokey. And have me read through all of it, and I'm going backwards, aren't I? Curse you, everything that looks the same! <laughs> ah, but yeah, Pokemon manga, and I just, in like less than three days, I finished. 14 volumes, which covers the entire red, blue, yellow, gold, silver, crystal arc. Mm -hmm. And they didn't release Ruby and Sapphire in America for some reason. Isn't it ironic that your least favorite games are your favorite mangas? Yeah. <laughs> hmm, based on the uh, thingy over there, I'm not sure if the people heard you. <laughs> Ah, here we are. Hey, you. You, talk to me. You're up. Okay. Ah! There we go. I tipped the mic in my favor. Let's see. Whoa, nice. Just between you and me, fur furry. Furry? <laughs> yes, he says furry. <laughs> Those Jet Force do-gooders want to break up uh, our little party. Having Mizar, Mizar in power isn't such a bad idea, you know? Could give us a lot of room for... Expansion. expansion. It looks like... <laughs> <laughs> and you don't really mind working for good old farmer, do you? Uh, come on. I, I'm, not, I'm not that bad. Anyway, you like my money? I, I, I like money. It's the perfect partnership. You never know. I might even start paying you one day. But don't hold your breath. Look, this is what Jet Force will get be after. Uh, if if I give it to you, can you go and buy it? So bury. bury it somewhere. I hate this font. Uh, sure thing, boss. I'll take care of it. And he pukes it up like everyone does. Spaceship part. I think it's uh, the deflector shield or something. Yes, we. It's like, yeah, thank you for giving us exactly what we want. We only have about 30 seconds left. All right, well, I'll go uh, de-transform off screen, okay? Okay. Stopping the video now. Yay.